In this particular contest, Coach, it was a very intense start for your team, and, and that was a marked difference from, from last night's game. And where did that intensity come from? Well, just dropping one last night, we wanted to come in here and protect our house and uh, play with a very high sense of urgency and just come out here and play tough and physical. So, you know, from the start, we wanted to kind of set the tone by doing that, and I think we did a good job throughout the whole game of setting the tone just being physical. And it's also a good thing to be able to erase last night's efforts and then just focus on what you have in front of you? For sure. That's the good thing about this league is that, uh, especially on these back-to-backs, if you lose the first one, you know, you get a chance to go right back out and, you know, go right and play again. So that was fortunate for us. We had a chance to uh, step up to the challenge and see if we could get a game after losing one, and, and we did that. Is it also good to see the emphasis on rebounding after last night's game and you were able to turn that around tonight? For sure. You know, that was one of our points of emphasis, just to kind of crash the boards, not just from our bigs, but from everybody. And I think we did a good job of making sure we, we paid attention to that detail and just going out there and crashing and just trying to be tough on the glass as well. And, you know, it showed in the game of the outcome of the game and the rebounding battle as well. Did also the pick and roll that you were able to work in the first quarter, did that kind of carry over from the fourth quarter last night and lead you to some open shots? Yeah, you know, I think we got some of the best guards in the league. And if you put them in pick and roll and put them in actions, you know, once they start getting downhill and making the right plays, the right passes, it's really hard to stop them. So, you know, we were able to use that to our advantage um, with Bouye and Drew and even Mike and DJ getting them downhill. So, you know, that's something we'll look to continue to do. All right, we'll see if it happens again on Tuesday night against the Legends. Thank you. Happy New Year, my guy. Sam, two consecutive games against the Ontario Clippers. Can you tell if there was a big difference between the two games that you guys played? Yeah, I mean, I think that we were, our attention to detail was better in the second game. You know, we got out-rebounded by 20, which is usually a positioning and an effort thing. Um, we, we rebounded the ball better today. Uh, we had some costly late-game turnovers. We executed a little bit better today. I think we did a better job until, you know, late in that fourth quarter. I think we did a really good job defensively. So I think that we were just that much more locked in and uh, did the small things. When you look at the offense and being able to work the pick and roll, did that free you up for the better outside shots and you were able to convert them a little bit better tonight? Yeah, you know, uh, yesterday was a first game after a little bit of a break. Uh, We were trying to work in three new guys, um, guys that never played with each other before. We didn't have a chance to practice any of that. So there was always going to be a bit of an adjustment period. But um, I think that we uh, we played a little bit with a little bit more precision today. I think we had better space and better pace. Um, you know, I keep saying it with better attention to detail, and we were, better, we were able to get shots that were in rhythm as opposed to, you know, kind of just swinging it around and, and tossing them up. What about the mental focus to be able to, to lock in and, and try to play the five when, when you're, you're kind of pressed into that duty with, with uh, Kadeem starting and then you coming off the bench to spell him? Yeah, you know, it's a uh, – this league is a crazy league, man. You know, you know this league better than most people. It's, uh, you kind of got to be ready when your number is called to do whatever it takes to win the game for the team. And, um, you know, I'm trying to work myself back into rhythm, back into, um, you know, back into it with this team and uh, just 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 play with effort, play with energy, uh, try and create action and uh, just try and win ball games. Congratulations on the win. Thanks thank for the time. You, thank you. Thank you. If you love Sioux Falls Skyforce basketball, please support this channel by liking, subscribing and commenting.